Hello everybody, I'm GHG and welcome back to this tutorial series and in today's episode we are going to take a look at how scores are ordered on the scoreboard. But first let us add two other scores so that we can see the difference between our current score and the other scores. So what I'm actually going to do is I'm going to create a new score called money and objective.getScore and I'm going to give it a little chat color dot green plus money and then I'm gonna give money dot set score I'm gonna give this one 10 now you can also take a config value over here but I'm not gonna do that because this tutorial is about scoreboards and I already made something about config and as last I want to do xp objective dot get score this is of course not the xp of the xp bar down in the uh, uh, next to the health bar and uh, hunger bar but just a custom xp and i'm gonna give that chat color the blue plus xp double dot and i'm gonna set the score of xp to zero and now we're gonna check how these are ordered so the first one just gets the value of one in case of my uh the, the online players is one in case of my uh, custom server and the money is going to be 10 and the XP is going to be 0 and let's go check it out on the server. So we're inside Minecraft now, I've started the server and let's go take a look. And as you can see, uh, money is going to be on top and it has a value of 10. Players is going to be the second value of 1 and XP is going to be 0. And it actually, just like a real scoreboard, like puts the high score up on the top and then the, uh, the lower one, lower one, uh, down until we get the lowest one, in this case XP. But Maybe you don't want to have these things switching around all the time. Like if I now suddenly ten more players join, money is second, and player and players is gonna be first. Or if I actually uh, pay the ten, uh, the ten money, the ten coins, then uh, it's gonna be the X to XP. So uh, let's go back to Eclipse, and I will explain a little workaround for that. And see you there. So we're back at the, the coding part again. And what we actually want to do is we want to fix the score because the score determines the order. The higher the score is, the higher it will be on the scoreboard. So we're just going to give it a fixed number of two in this case because there's only one player online at the whole time on my server. And I'm just going to keep XP to zero. But how do we then still display the money? Now that's actually pretty simple because we can also display things over here in, in the, the score name, in the entry. Uh, just Place a little space bar over there. I'm gonna do it back to check color the white, and I'm gonna add my money, my 10 coins, and then I'm gonna do the same over here for XP. So I'm gonna change it. Don't forget the spacer will glue the number to the thing, and you can actually use a number in a string as long as there is a string attached to it. Attached to it. So as long as you have uh, these curly bra these these uh, brackets. Yeah, I don't know how they're called. Um, and over here I'm going to do 5. Oh, I'm going to do 5. And that's it for the coding part. If you want to know how to change them, go ahead. Challenge yourself. Try to find it out yourself. If you cannot uh, find or figure it out, uh, then just shoot me a message at the Discord and I will be able to help you out. Or somebody else will help you out. Uh, or you can just cheat. Um, and that's it for the coding part. And uh, let's go check this out on the server once again. So we're back inside of Minecraft, I started up the server once again and let's go take a look at what we have created. And as you can see, you can see the value of 0 over there, the value of 1, value of 2, the order is, is uh, pretty now. I have did not change the players because you can change it yourself if you know how to uh, do money and XP. And as you can see money 10, XP 5, if I would do XP 100 it would still remain at the bottom of the scoreboard because it's not inside the score, it's inside like the name. And that's it for the episode. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe. If you've got any feedback or suggestions, there's a, disc a link to our Discord down below in the description box. Or just post a comment. Uh, hope you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Bye.